going funky. Go funky. it is me I'll talk on minor and welcome to a brand new video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install and play five nights at Freddy's fan games all right the first thing you want to do you want to go up to the search bar and you want to search up game jolt uh, oops, dot com and then you want to search that up you want to go to game jolt um, now Game Jolt obviously has more than just Five Nights at Freddy's fan games. Game Jolt, I'm not sure if every game is Game Jolt on Game Jolt is free. I'm pretty sure all of them are. Uh, so it's like, yeah. Well, nope. Apparently not. But most games are free, which is awesome. Um, most fan games, that is. Alright, so... If you search up any Five Nights at Freddy's fan game, like, let's take for instance, Five Night. What am I doing? Five Nights at Candies. Uh, any of them. It'll show up, like, right here. And then if you go here into your little. Uh, this three stack of bars right here. And then you go to, like,. You can like go down here and sometimes it'll say like recently used tags and it'll say like five nights at Freddy's but I'm not sure why that's not showing up here. So let me reload the page and see if it shows up. Hopefully it does. Nope. Cause for whatever reason it's not. Um, but yeah, um, if you want to look up a variety of them, you can just search five, why do I keep spelling that wrong, five nights at Freddy's, and then you can like search that, <laughs> sorry, I got allergies for acting up, and then you got all these different games, now this is five nights at Freddy's for free it says I don't know what that's about but Five Nights at Freddy's 2 3D um Five Nights at Freddy's with a picture of a flower that doesn't look very scary Five Nights at Freddy's, Five Nights at Golden Freddy's and all this good stuff and then you can go to like games and it says there are 589 games so you get 589 free Five Nights at Freddy's games so yeah, um, and if you want to know how to install these, like, let's take this game for instance. Hopefully this one has already been done with development. Yeah. Yeah, it has. Okay. So you want to go here, and you're going to click download right here. Alright, you click download. And then, when that's done, you want to click on this little Windows thing down here, or you can press the Windows button on your keyboard. Uh, here's my keyboard. I don't know if you can see what I'm pressing, but I, I'm pressing it. So, uh, you can do that, and then you want to search up, like, let's search up a game that I already have. I'm going to search Five Nights. Actually, no, 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 no. The. Hold on. Uh, hold on. I'm trying to look this up. Here's a. There's a game that I already have. Really? Uh, I can't find it. Oh well. Uh, well, let's search up a game that I know I definitely do have. Like, let's just search up FNAF World. That is also an official Five Nights at Freddy's game for free, made by Scott Cawthon himself. Uh, and then you wanna 
click on it and then you'll click run but I don't want to play right now so press cancel so that is how you install and play Five Nights at Freddy's fan games if you want to play official ones go to Steam because I know anybody who pays for computer games usually will go on Steam rather than Game Joel. Game Joel is more of a place for free games rather than paid games, so I'm sure you all know what Steam is. The official Five Nights at Freddy's games are on there, and I will see you guys next time.